Merry Christmas everyone, this is Blue, and welcome back to some more Sonic Lost World mods. Okay, so as you can tell already, I have a mod installed by the Merry Christmas things floating around in the clouds, or maybe it's just really good editing. Who knows? <laughs> okay, but um, let's start this video, so we press start and go to continue. Okay, so you can, you can already see the changes here. I have the Christmas Sonic mod on. As you can see, it's Sonic and his uh, Christmas model. I'll, we'll take a closer look at that. As you can see here, it's Sonic and his Christmas model. So here we go. It is the same Sonic model, really, but you know, for some reason he has some weird hand hook candy cane glove thing. I have no idea what's up with his hand, but uh, <laughs> he also has this weird hat which has three little balls on it for some reason. Is it three or two? I don't know. I think it's just two. Yeah, he has weird, like, two uh, ball things on his, like, hat for some reason. And uh, someone is calling me on Skype. Hold up. <laughs> well, that was strange. But anyway, we're going, we're going to go back into the rest of the showcase. Okay, so, wait. Are there three... I don't know, it seems to go from between two or three balls on top of the hat, but whatever, <laughs> we're just gonna go into Frosty Hill. So as you can tell, it's Windy Hill in Wonderland, in Winter Wonderland, because everything is all cold and icy and snowy and all that kind of stuff, so it's cool. It's cool to see something like that, but um, yeah, I mean, you can see everything, you mean, you can see like the little... All the textures are on top are all like covered in snow and even the trees and everything too It would have been cool if like the water was actually frozen. I, I'm gonna go back a little bit so you can go back to the I can see the water There it is see the water is not frozen which it would have been a nice touch if it was I don't know if it's possible though I don't know it might, it might be who knows <laughs> But uh, I'm just going to free these animals because the animals are actually replaced by um, presents. So if you rescue pre if you if you rescue presents, if you rescue animals, they'll give you presents. At least that's what I assume is the explanation for them turning into presents. But um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, as you can see, the HUD's been changed a little bit. You know, you, you got Sonic with a Christmas hat over there. You know, <laughs> just just kind of basic stuff. But, you know, whatever. And also you can tell that uh, the creator actually changed the music for the stages as well, so that's a thing. And we're just gonna go over here. Okay, so uh, one thing about this, uh, one thing that I want to ask actually is, um, how is your guys' Christmas? See, I mean, I only celebrate Christmas one way, and I've only done that for like ever now. Probably next Christmas or something. I'm probably gonna spend it with friends or something like that. Just go, just go somewhere else for Christmas. But I've never really had a Christmas just that's not with my family before because I'm only like 17, so <laughs> I've never really had an opportunity for something like that before. But um, what did you guys get for Christmas? What are your Christmas traditions? What's all that? I really want to know because I've only celebrated Christmas one way, and um. I don't know. I want to see if it's any different from the way how I do it. Because usually, I don't know how a lot of people do Christmas. Because, okay. So basically what happens... Wow, I died. <laughs> uh, as they try to scale the wall. But um, basically my basically my family so far for like years now, it's always been like Christmas Eve is always like this big get-together gathering, gathering, whatever you would like to call it. And uh, Christmas Day is just kind of like chill really no, nothing really happens oh damn it I was so close <laughs> so I actually want to know what you guys do on your what, what you guys do for Christmas what what are your traditions all that kind of stuff because I don't know it's interesting it's interesting to see how different people celebrate holidays like that I mean I know a lot of people celebrate Thanksgiving in different ways than my family does <laughs> and uh, yeah hold on I'm gonna see if I scale the wall can I can I can I? Ah, oh, damn it. Hold on. I'm going to wait to scale the wall. I'm going to do that. <laughs> but, uh, oh, wait. Also, one thing. What did you guys get for Christmas? And also, I actually just realized I'm, well, actually, it is Christmas. So, whatever. I'm not going to bother with the Hanukkah questions. Whatever. I don't care. <laughs> this is Christmas Sonic. If there's a Jewish Sonic mod, I'd be asking you guys what you do for, like, 
I don't know. What is it? Hanukkah? <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, same thing to me. Yeah, I'm terrible. <laughs> uh, but, um... Yeah, what'd you guys get? I know, like, some people get, like, ridiculous things, like, overpowered computers and all that kind of stuff. I mean... And they get, like, games and all that. I mainly got clothes, to be honest. And, um... And, uh... Well, I got money, too, so money's always good. Oh, no, I'm not gonna make it. Oh, wait, I did! Alright, guys, so, uh... Welcome to Lost World. <laughs> yeah, we're scaling walls is, is amazing. I've actually just learned how to basically do the whole scaling walls trick. And it's super hard to do with the Omochao thing. Keep in the way like all the time I hate doing that but whatever <laughs> it's it's cool to see though I just try not to fall off uh, oh god <laughs> see I wanted to do this because this is so fun right here look at this <laughs> okay and oh, damn it messed up oh well frosty hill zone one clear So yeah, back to what you guys got for Christmas. <laughs> I just want to know because I got mainly clothes and money. You know, some people get like games and all that kind of stuff. I got my little brother something too. You know, all that kind of stuff. But, you know, I want to know what you guys got. Because I want to be jealous or uh, grateful that I got something better than you. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. But I just actually want to know. Damn, can't believe it. Zaz, on the day of Christmas, still wants to destroy Sonic. He'll just never learn, will he? What? So, okay. <laughs> okay, and you can see that I did like a little weird kind of hop after I did that little parkour thing. That's actually what the Sonic Lost World, um... That's actually what the Sonic Lost World, uh, tips and tricks thing from like the Sonic the Hedgehog Twitter said basically what you do is you parkour like on one of those really small looking ledges that you can parkour over and uh, you press like the the run button after that and so you do this little weird hop and that weird hop sent, sent me like propelling forward but too bad there was a pit right there so I just died so I'm not gonna be doing that yeah screw you Sonic the Hedgehog Twitter <laughs> oh god you know what would have been, you, you know what would have been really cool for this mod? Like, I've already played this mod before, obviously, but, uh, what the hell? <laughs> okay, um, one thing with this mod is that, oh, oh, Jesus, I lost where I was going. But, uh, one thing that would be cool with this mod is if they put, like, a Christmas hat on, the, like, a Santa hat on, like, San, uh, on, like, Santa, on, like, Zaz. <laughs> that would have been cool, but, oh, well, whatever, there's already Sonic, so, I guess the Zeddy don't celebrate Christmas. <laughs> Maybe they're ISIS members. I don't know what that has to do with anything, but whatever. <laughs> okay, there we go. Frosty Hill Zone 2 cleared. Now, Frosty Hill Zone 3, I will not be showing off. Why? Because there's no changes. And also, well, the only change that it has is it uses the Silent Force Zone 2 music. And that's it. <laughs> so, Frosty Hill Zone 4, we go. All right. So one thing that's actually pretty cool is that, uh, like, whenever you do like the dash pad thing, Sonic goes into like, like, into the that kind of like sledding, skiing kind of animation kind of thing. Which I mean, it kind of make it, it's kind of cool, but then again, I mean, unless like it's on ice, it doesn't really make too much sense either. I mean, snow can be a little bit slippery, yeah, but just I don't know about that. <laughs> uh, whatever. It's not something I'm gonna complain about, but just like, I mean, it's kind of cool, but it also just doesn't make sense, too. Because if he was just sliding around, why not just make everything ice and all that kind of stuff? But whatever, whatever, whatever. So, uh, we have Super Sonic, so I'm gonna show that off really quickly. Yeah, the only change in Super Sonic is uh, his uh, Super Sonic theme. That is the only difference in Super Sonic, so... After, uh, in a little bit, I'm going to revert back to regular, okay, I'm just going to revert, revert back to regular Sonic right now. Because, I mean, all it was was just, like, music, that was it. There was no, like, actual model change. See, there you go, that's what you're supposed to be doing. Look at that. Like, basically, when you're, 
when you're climbing up and you're almost up to the edge, you just press the run button again, you do this little thing. I never knew you could do that, actually, until the Sonic the Hedgehog Twitter said it in, like, a picture or something like that. But, yeah, I'm gonna do it again, because it actually kind of looks cool when it works and doesn't throw you into pits. Actually, wait, let me see if I can do it again. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, yeah, that was about to propel me to my death. So, yeah, I'm not gonna be using that too much anymore. <laughs> oh, God. I'm gonna turn supersonic right here so I don't lose any rings. And there we go. I'm done. <laughs> One thing I do like about Sonic Lost World is that you can actually turn off supersonic whenever you want. But the thing is, when you do that, um, you can go just below 50 rings and you'll never be able to transform back. That kind of sucks. <laughs> oh, well. Okay, here we go. And now we're almost there, almost to that really easy boss that is somehow easier than the first boss in the game, which is Zaz again. But still, like I don't, I don't even get it. How do you, how does it get so easy like that? I, the the bosses in Sonic Lost World are like the biggest joke of like all time, to be honest. Because the, the, literally, you don't do anything. I'm not doing that trick. And, oh, oh, wow! I didn't have enough momentum. Screw me. <sighs> but um yeah i don't get the point of the of the lost world bosses if they're gonna be so ridiculously easy like i honestly i would rather uh, i just rather have no bosses at all to be honest i mean sure the story wouldn't make much sense if sonic didn't even at least fight those things but still i mean to be honest there's really nothing going on with them so what's even the point all right, Zaz, it's over. It's over. I'm going to show you the power of the Holiday Spirit. And I'm just going to see if I can collect the ring so I can, like, make a complete joke out of him. No, I can. Okay. <laughs> That's cool. And, uh, he's going to try to hammer me. No, thanks. Supersonic. There you go. See, okay, one thing about the supersonic transformation in this game is that I'm so glad they, like, made it, like, not take forever and a half. Because the thing about supersonic was that, I mean, he would be introduced in the games again, and I'm glad for that. But the thing is, the time that it takes you to turn supersonic leaves you completely vulnerable, so you can actually get hit by enemies. So I never really liked that about Generations. I'm so glad that they just stop time whenever you turn supersonic in this game. That's one thing I can say. I, I, I appreciate. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, guys. Well, that was basically it for this ep for this part. Uh, this part. This episode of, of this, this video. This video of Sonic Lost World mods. So, uh, Merry Christmas. I hope you had a really good one. And um, be sure to tell me. I mean, what, how did you celebrate? What would you get? All that kind of stuff. And uh, until next time, see ya.